This is Lady TZCD coming back at you behind the camera. Uh, doing a quick video, letting y'all show what I'm doing. I've been working downstairs, doing some cleaning, doing some refreshing. And so I want to show you guys um, what I'm doing in my family room. Now this is another angle from my home downstairs. Um, and I'm filming from the kitchen area going into the family room. First of all, thank y'all for watching. This is Lady TZCD coming back at you with a quick video. Uh, happy hump day. I think I did all that. And so I just wanted to just jump into the video because I hope this won't be anything long or, or whatsoever. So let me just show you guys what I've done. So I'm going to come behind the uh, aisle and, uh, in the kitchen. That's my tablet. They're charging. And so I'm going to show you the pop of color now. This is what I have going on. I have like a, I would say, as y'all have heard in other videos, I've explained my decorating style, if you want to call it that. I have a uh, farmhouse, modern farmhouse look. That's what I feel like it is. Bungalow, um, um, not bungalow, but um, boho, trying to just blend in together those two styles so um i will have to go out and just start all over and try to make this look different i like this warm welcoming feel of this particular design i have going on so i'm just sticking with it and adding to it for the summer so with that being said let me walk over here y'all i don't know if y'all seen the tablescape um the, of this little kitchenette i think i did show y'all that before but my main thing I want to show y'all is this beautiful pop of butterscotch yellow. I would say just a, like a little deeper color yellow throw. I love you talking about texture. And I love to blend different textures together, different type of patterns and what have you. And then the pop of color together, for me, it just gives me a thrill. I love how that looks, the feel of it, and it's very, very soft. So, and just to put over this neutral color sofa that we have had for years, <laughs> just give it a new life and give it a more refreshing look. So yeah, I got this beautiful um, throw from Tuesday morning. It was $19.99. I love it. I love the little tassels on the end. And I just throw, I just throw my throws over the sofa. So, you know, it's there. You can grab it to just, you know, cuddle and, and wrap up in and, and be warm in and cozy in. So that pop of yellow matches the those ombre pillows over there. And so I went um out and just pulled out in my stash that I have in the uh, garage. I have a stash a lot of pillows, y'all. I mean a stash, a stash of stored pillows. If you can say that three times fast. And so I just pulled this pillow back in and just um threw it over this chair. Now this um throw here is the checkerboard um buffalo check that I love. And, you know, as far as the chair itself, I've had it for years. Instead of trying to, re I would love to repost, uh, do a reposting of it, uh, put some new fabric on it and just, you know, give it new life. But that's down the road. I was thinking about doing it instead of just replacing the whole chair because the chair is, a, it has great bones and there's no need to um, just buy a whole other chair. So this is what I'm doing to pull together and it definitely looks nice. I mean, with the pillow and the blanket, it's, you know, it definitely looks nice together. So that's how you do that without, you know, trying to go and put, <laughs> for me, my budget does not allow me right now to get a whole other chair, sugarboard chair. But what I want to show you is just the pop of color that I'm bringing in here, which is that yellow butter scotch. I would say like a more deeper yellow, um, just blend in with that black and white. That's what I'm trying to say. That pillow behind that home sweet home. That's one of my fall winter pillows that I pulled out in the garage and put it, placed it behind here. Again, the texture, the fur, the fluffiness of it all, you know, blending together with this pattern here. So I love the way that looks together. Grouping the pillows together. And one day I do want to replace this uh, sectional uh, L shape sofa for right now is lived in it's loved you plop down on it and sometimes you know it's best to just have something that you 
are used to, you know, it's already worn, it's already broken in, and you don't have to worry about trying to replace it right now. Just keep on, you know, refreshing it with pillows and throws. And that's my whole uh, concept of that. So I'm gonna turn around real quick. I purchased this um, picture right here from Tuesday morning. And Tuesday morning is so close to me, it's right up the street. I can just go run up there and get, you know, whatever uh, item I, I choose to, you know, refresh my home with. And I always start off with that location first because it's so close to the house. But I picked this up, I love this. I think this goes better. Um, that picture behind it, I've spent, you know, I've had it for a long time. And if y'all seen other videos, y'all know how that picture looks. And I've had it for years. But I'm kind of tired of it. And I think it, you know, I try to blend in with the rest of the uh, decorations that I already had decor in here. But I think this looks better. So I got this for $39.99. And it is more of a cohesive look to pull all the, you know, elements of the farmhouse modern boho look that I have going on. I bought it for my bathroom, but I said, you know what? It looks good over the fireplace and it brightens up the room as well. So I'm going to take that one down, get my husband to take that one down and put this one up. And I set it up here just to get an idea of how it would look. And it looks great. Fell in love with it as soon as I put it up there. I thought it would maybe too small, but no, it's not too small. It's just right. So I just love the color and the colors that's in this print okay that's all i want to show you that's all i got going on right now but um this new i just want to do a quick video let y'all see what i'm doing what i'm working on um trying to pull this uh, room together with a little smile friendly budget and i hope y'all enjoy watching please comment below tell me what you guys think when i get done with the whole thing i will um uh, because i'm gonna redo my bathroom as well so yeah Please comment below, like, share, hit the notification button if you have not um, done so, done so, so you can get all my uploaded videos. Subscribe, please do that. I would love to have you guys as a subby, and the ones that have already done that, thank y'all for doing so. I'm gonna jump off. Have a great Wednesday. Goodbye.